Hi friends, welcome to my Pingaksh YouTube channel. Let's today start with noun and the number means this noun uh, is singular number and plural number. So, see, singular number noun is a noun refers to one person or one animal or one thing. That is we'll call the singular number. Plural number, a noun that refers to more than one person or one animal or one thing. That is the plural number. Now, the nouns means the words that end with ch, sh, s, double s or x. We change those noun in plurals. So, how will we change? We will put es. See, if I write church, the last word is ch. It will change to es, churches, church, churches, radish, sh radishes bus buses glass glasses fax faxes lunch lunches tax taxes marsh marshes this way okay now the nouns that end with o last word is o see so that i will change by saying es adding es that will become plural potato Potatoes, tomato, here is O, tomatoes, buffalo, buffaloes, eco, echoes, volcano, volcanoes, hero, heroes. Some nouns that ends with F or EF, sorry, FE at last, what do we do? We are adding VE and S in plural, V S means like loaf, this F will change into ves loaves wolf wolves knife knives wife wives roof these are the exceptions you see here the f will not change into ves we are adding simply s here these are the exceptions like see roof roofs chief chiefs belief believes chef chefs in these words, we are not adding V-E-S. Now, some nouns are there that end with Y. But before Y, there is a consonant. Consonant means except the vowels. Vowels are A, E, I, O, U. Except that, whatever remained, that is the consonant. So, see Y, before Y is L. L is a consonant. Y, before Y is here, H. This is T before Y, T before Y, P before Y. D means all these are consonants before Y. Then what do we do? We are changing it by writing I, E, uh, S. See, family, families. This is why I am changing this Y into I, E, S. As because there is a consonant. Trophy, trophies. University, universities. City, cities. Puppy, puppies. Lady, ladies. Lorry. Lorries, Mary, Marys. The Y will be replaced with I, E, S in the plural. Now some nouns end with the vowel before Y. Like here uh, we had consonants before Y. Here you see before Y there is A. Here before Y, E. Here E. Here also O. O is a vowel. O is a vowel. E, A. So our five vowels A, E, I, O, U. They are coming before this Y. So what do we do? We just simple add S with that. No IES. Ray, rays. Turkey, turkeys. Valley, valleys. Boy, boys. Toy, toys. Monkey, monkeys. Tray, trees. This way, we are adding the S in the Y uh, in the uh, words which are ending with Y and there is vowel before Y. Now, what do we uh, do here? See, if the nouns, they are just the regular nouns. We are just adding S in them. See here, cat, cats, bat, bats, house, houses, mat, mats, table, tables, like that, pen, pens. We are adding simple S with those nouns right now some nouns they do not change 
when they are uh, pluralized when they do not change when they become plural they remain as it is and they are called the zero plurals like you see sheep sheep if one sheep is there we will say sheep if there are two sheep or uh, five sheep then also we will not say sheep we will say sheep series same series one deer also deer five deer also deer not deers moose moose bison bison aircraft aircraft fish this is also fish if there are 10 fishes we will not say fishes only fish salmon salmon spacecraft spacecraft hovercraft this is all same will be there hovercraft watercraft watercraft so these are the words they will not change even if they become plural okay now some irregular uh, singular plural, plurals are there see they we will have to uh, know them by that only there is no such rules for them but they are differently like that see loves lies mouse mice die dies ox oxen this is very different you know ox oxen we are not using s or v s like that ox oxen child one child is child more children we will call children okay this is fungus fungi nucleus nuclei this way so they don't have any such rules and they are like that only radius radi cactus cacti axis axis crisis crises phenomenon phenomena criterion criteria alum alumnus alumni so these are the words which are totally different they are irregular singular plural words nouns and that remain like that so i think you have understood thank you for uh, watching my video and please wait for my next video